And we're back to this. I want 58, by the way. Can you believe it? <clears throat> I got good news, bad news for everybody. I'll wait till this loads before I start explaining that. The good news? I got the promo. Hang on a sec. Yep, I got the promo. There you go. Um, hang on a sec. Where is it? I was able to get it finally. They gave me my codes. They gave me them um, yesterday morning. Woo! Woo! So yeah. Um. Now for the bad news. I didn't get all the armor within the area. Got most of it though, in the weapon. But at the same time, I couldn't really. Even know I should. But that's okay. We don't need that much power. I don't think. Oh yeah, that one reminds me. I need to change that. So I like that. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, let's continue the story, shall we? The song begins. I gotta pull up the um, information. Man, we are really, we are really far into this. Oh yeah, let's take this moment to actually so I can officially say. If I wanted to, I could make Ron the actual Monkey King of Eorzea. And he'd be the true one, too. Considering his his past and the fact that he has actual Mr. Mon Monkey powers. Like... The only problem is, I don't know how to do the, use the prism stuff. So, that's the only problem. Speak with the sh Um, we are filling in the maps, so... Whoa, what the frick? Is that the s Oh yeah, I should check that. Um. Oh, don't play this one. Oh, it's the s It's just the same one. That's disappointing. 
It would have been cool if this gave you a new song, like a special song. But no, can't. I get. I'm so annoyed by that song. I've let, uh, quite a bit. We're gonna fill in the map before we do anything else. Like, if I need to, I can still grind the dungeon if I need to for gear, if I can't deal with things. I found the barrier. Whoa. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's that's the end of the world, right? The edge right there. Apparently you can't go down any further. This is the barrier. There it is. Everything okay, this whole realm is mapped.
Hi! Was you, was it not? Yay, we're gonna learn something! We're gonna learn the actual truth. I prized your eye from his head. At least we give it back. Oh, guess what? Got a vision.
It was yours! Your strength that sustained Nidhogg all these years! Would that Haldreth had dealt the worm a killing blow. And so you acquiesced. You surrendered your eye to Nidhogg, knowing full well the suffering he would inflict. Oh, really? This means From what I see, I think I've, I think Ishgar deserves it. opinion Ishgard, Ish, Ishgard she just burned to the ground as if there's actually people that are willing to kill dragons for power back then imagine now mm -hmm. and, ooh oh what the frick 139 He doesn't need to. Hazelar doesn't need to fight if he wants to accept. It was my revenge. life's goal to slay Nidhogg, but I find there is little joy to be had in its accomplishment. But you have rid the world of a hate-filled creature, and ended a bloody war in so doing. I lost my family to Nidhogg's flames, and was with fury in my heart that I took up the lance. Every blow I struck, I struck in the name of vengeance. We were not so different, he and I. I will not judge you for your deeds. I have not the right. Too many innocents have perished in the name of my greater good. Yet even with all that has passed, the tale is incomplete. We are short a great worm's eye. Of the pair which Haldreth took from Nidhogg, only one is known to us, the one I bear. What then became of the other? Why did Nidhogg, who had taken such pains to prolong the Dragonsong War, suddenly decide to hurl his entire army against the walls of Ishgard? Lord Commander. He might have found the I... other eye. The deed is done. Nidhogg is slain. What? In the city? A battle with whom? At once, Lord Commander. Hold firm till our return. Fighting has broken out in the city. Lord Emmerich was sparse with the particulars, but it seems some commoners threw open the gates to a force of heretics. I gave no order to attack. Are we to mark the end of the Dragon Song War by spilling the blood of our own? Mayhap Praisvogel was right about us. Let us away, Warrior of Light. The people must be saved from themselves. 
Wait! I would join you! There has been enough violence. I will appeal to my people in the city and make them see reason. Come then, Lady Iceheart. Let us write the final chapter in this damnable war. Heretics has invaded the city, Your Eminence. But there is no cause for concern. A sizable contingent of our soldiers is already in place to repel the Dravanian assault. And the intruders will soon find themselves outnumbered and outmatched. Our plans proceed apace, then? Yes, Your Eminence. This unrest shall serve to feed the people's fear of the heretics and the dragons both. Uh oh, so it sounds like they set it up. Lend renewed fervor to their prayers for deliverance. Very good. Grant our guests what time they need to sow a measure of chaos, then order the Temple Knights to crush them. Your will be done. What is he planning? The moment is at hand. Big. Excellent. All shall soon be in alignment. It is time for the bringer of light to die. Swords! There is no need for further bloodshed! My lady! She is come! No. 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 Hear me, brothers and sisters! The war is ended! Nidhogg is no more! <laughs> Well, I'm going home. Aye! It is so! This adventurer and the Azure Dragoon laid the Great Worm low! <clears throat> the endless cycle of violence between man and dragon was born of our forefathers' treachery. You have followed me, bled with me, to bring this truth to light that we might all know peace. 
The Nidhogg is dead. Nidhogg is dead, my friends. He who bore such hatred towards Ishgard is dead. Let his hatred die with him, I say. Let us sheathe our swords and go in peace. Have we lost? No, my friend. Far from it. At long last, the peace for which we have so desperately fought is within our grasp. And I, for one, would not forsake it. Peace? <laughs> like, we're done. Time to go home. Seize the witch! Let none escape! Providing aid and succor to the wounded should be our first concern. If the heretics mean to observe the peace, then it would be folly not to do the same. Mind, however, yet. Trust me, it could have been worse. What not denied? Wait. Okay, um. Hang on. We need to go here. Ah, uh, yeah. Finally, I have it. Yep, we're doing the next one. It's where we've begun doing level 56, um... I'm hoping to get to 
I guess the trial? No. I think we could get further. I'm not sure yet. There's a there's a trial later on in the game. I wanna at least try to get to that today. Or morning. That would mean that would put me in a position that's like really far. Excuse me, come through. Excuse me, come through. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm awesome. Okay, um... By the way, I changed my stuff around, so... Oh, what the... Oh yeah, I forgot. So hard. There we go. Wow. Like seriously, that that's not cool. Wow. Maybe I should go back and grind for um the gear inside of which we call it. Or if I can just survive until um, the next dungeon, I'll definitely grind all the gear for that.
In the beginning. <laughs> Alright, let's do Don't worry, I will continue my training. <laughs> Yay! Um... Delivers an attack with a boost to all near eye enemies. <gasps> oh, it's a 30 second! That's actually cool. The other one is like... If I remember, the other one is... The one I w was using is actually like... I think it's like... 60 seconds, yep. Ooh. It's gonna be fun to play with. 
Oh, see y'all at 58! <clears throat> um... Okay, um, we're going to go back to... Foundation. Uh, use an ether uh, ticket. Yeah, they gave me tickets too, apparently. I think he came with the cloud. No, he came with the... He either came with the cloud or the staff. I think it was the staff. On the promo. Salone, you are safe. My safety was never in doubt, Father. For I had the Azure Dragoon and the Warrior of Light by my side. We bring the most wonderful tidings. The infamous Lady Iceheart, here in Ishgard? This is most unexpected. She has done much to quell the violence. The Inquisition may not approve, but we are glad of her presence. And with the Great Worm's demise, even our nation's more reactionary elements will have scant grounds to press for her immediate impeachment. My thoughts exactly. What of the truth revealed to us by Hreisvalga? That the origins of the Dragonsong War, a core tenet of Ishgardian faith, are quite unlike those depicted in the scriptures. That men and dragons once lived together in harmony, and that it was man's treachery which shattered the peace and plunged our peoples into war. The same scripture also describes the origins of the High Houses. Were it exposed as false, the legitimacy of our rule will be called into question. If both Highborn and Lowborn can trace their ancestry to Thorden and his Knights Twelve. But a single sip of Dragon's blood is required to confirm their lineage. If the Holy See knew of this and chose to remain silent, their crimes are grievous indeed. Regardless, this state of affairs cannot be allowed to continue. Sir Emmerich, you cannot mean to raise this matter with the Archbishop. Pray consider what you are proposing. If the Holy See chose to conceal the truth for centuries, what reason would they have to reveal it now? Exactly. They're not gonna... And if you walk in there and start spreading the, it starts talking about this to the bishop, they're gonna shut you up fast. You won't make At it best, out of that place. You will be branded a heretic in Clapton Irons. And that too. Then at least the archbishop will have shown his true colors. My friends, this war will never truly be at an end until the truth is made known. You must see what lies on the horizon if it is not. When ruled by fear of a common enemy, we were united. But now we have none. 
During the war, the highborn needed men to lead, and the lowborn men to follow. Not anymore. Tis but a matter of time before the old order is called into question. Lady Iceheart will share the truth with her followers, and the Holy See will be powerless to stop its spread. The disenfranchised will rise up united, and blood will flow in the streets once more. A divided Ishgard will not survive. He's right. It'd end up destroying itself. Tread carefully, Lord Commander. My lady, is it wise to let him go? I sympathize with the Lord Commander's desire for reform. But to approach the Archbishop in this manner bespeaks an idealism to which I did not think Sir Emmerich prone. Though he comports himself as a realist, he has long dreamt of reform. It was that idealism which first drew me to him. That which made me swear an oath to serve. We must not think of ways to hinder his cause, but rather ways to aid it. Even should the Holy See cry heresy. You cannot mean... If the Lord Commander does not return from the vault at the appointed hour, I mean to go and fetch him. Have care, my lady. Your words border on treason. Should they reach the wrong ears, you will be declared an enemy of Ishgard. I think everybody in Ishgard is an enemy of Ishgard. At that is a point. risk I am willing to take. Lest you forget, my lord, I am not born of this land. My loyalty is to the Lord Commander alone. But I speak only of what may come to pass. If the rumors regarding his heritage are to be believed, we have naught to fear. <laughs> Lies and slander. Forgive me, what rumors are these? That Sir Emmerich is the Archbishop's bastard son. Senior clergy are not permitted to marry and sire children. But even the holiest among us are not immune to temptation. <laughs> of course. I labor to believe it. Sir Emmerich is truly the Archbishop's son. He has never been publicly acknowledged as such. But the rumors have plagued him since childhood. That he rose to his current position, despite being despised as a bastard and accused of profiting from his father's influence, bespeaks the quality of his character. It is my hope that on this occasion, the burden of his birth will work in his favor. Should our worst fears be realized, the Archbishop will not be so quick to execute his own flesh and blood, affording us time to mount a rescue. Bastard or trueborn, he is our nation's best hope. If the Holy See dares to threaten him, I shall lead the charge against the Vault myself. Hear, hear! The future of Ishgard rests on Sir Emmerich's shoulders. I, too, will do mine utmost to aid his cause. Jeez. Orshafon, be reasonable. A knight lives to serve, father. To aid those in need. The people need Sir Emmerich more than ever. And we may be his only hope. There is no greater calling for a knight than to save the life of his fellow man. I swear to you, on the sigil of our house, that I shall do this, and make you proud. Even you? <laughs> Romantic, reckless fools the lot of you. So be it. Make your preparations. I thank you all for your support. <laughs> Jeez. Damn leggings. Um, safe. I think there's no point in looking at this now, considering.
Yep, accuracy is still lower than the um. But that's okay. The strength is all that matters. I trust me, I can hit stuff. Are these boots? Yeah, they're legs. Wait. I just put legs on. Oh. It's more legs. Oh. What's this? Honoring the past. What's this one connected to? I'll have to check it later. Everything's coming together! I think once I'm complete all I can between Heaven's Word and within Heaven's Word, if there's still time before Stormblood comes out, I will go back to a Realm Reborn and see what I can do inside there, and along with, um, because there's still, I forgot there are a couple of things that, what the frick? Well, 
That was easy. So I'd like to check out the hunts and stuff. Sitting on a gold mine with this to whoa. sleep schedule is completely messed up now and it's gonna get a lot worse um, all this week because I will be gone Thursday and Friday which is sad I have to go I have to deal with some personal things with family Let's take a moment to do something real quick. Because I know I, I, I've been wanting to do it for a while. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um. Wow. You sell for quite a bit. I need to keep that. the bell here? Or summoning bell? Oh, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. I see it. I don't know why, but I have this problem with keeping large amounts of money on me. Like, I don't like doing it. What? Um. Yeah. That should do it. Be well. You're not currently selling anything. So let's sell something. Let's sell our souls. Oh yeah, I do have the pieces, don't I? Wait. Can I? No, I can't. Whoa, I have Nicole's coin? Wait, 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 come back! <laughs> I didn't notice that until now. I do, I have Nicole's. I have Nicole's. What should we call it? Oh, yeah, I have that too. I have knit. I have knit. I have nails. Very hard card. That's all about it.
<laughs> well, you're gonna hand. No, I was thinking of keeping them. I'm losing health more than I gain. Let's... I keep having to think about things.
Starting to figure. I'm starting to see a pattern here. Is the leader we're looking for this the child? Because all of that would make sense. Thousand damage from that small fall. Four thousand from that. I'm starting to see a pattern again. I take fall damage. Whoa. We talked to her the first time.
Oh wait, one person. Where do you think you're going, Missy? I-I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend. What's going on here? What's it to you, boy? Piss off. Hold on. I've seen them around. They're in and out of House Four Tom's Manor all the time. Oh, I see. Skulking about at your highborn master's bidding, eh? Bloodhounds hoping to catch a whiff of heresy, is that it? You are quite mistaken, I assure you. We came here to help. And if you know what's good for you, you will let us pass. Ha <laughs> ha! Listen to the pups yapping. Come here, boy. I'll give you cause to yelp. Enough! Leave threatening women and children to our betters. We don't have the knack. Killed her. Lay a finger on the blue blood's pups, and you're like to lose the hand. In often I get called on by glorious heroes like yourself. So tell me, what have I done to deserve you? Well then.
I can do this. I can get up there. I can. level is 59. I'm sadly nowhere near that. Get in there. Just think two more levels. the whole place. way to kill Nidhogg, you stumbled on some dirty secrets that the Holy See has been hiding for centuries. Eh? What are they on about? The High Houses. And what makes a nobleman so bleeding noble? They trace their blood back to King Thordon and his Knights Twelve, the founders of Ishgard. But our friends here reckon we're all descended from the heroes of Eld. Highborn and lowborn alike. And so Sir Emmerich, Lord Commander of the Temple Knights, has gone to ask the Archbishop if he wouldn't mind letting everyone know. Yeah. Is he simple? The old bastard will have him executed for heresy. Well, seems to me that's what the good sir wants. Seems he thinks a noble sacrifice will serve to prove his claims. Exactly. We cannot stand idly by and allow Sir Emmerich to do this. Ishgard has need of him. Look, you've a good heart, I can see that. Willing to risk your neck for someone else even when his troubles ain't yours. But what's this got to do with me? If Sir Emmerich is imprisoned in the vault, we will need all the help we can muster to breach their defenses and rescue him. The unmistakable scent of heresy. And what do we have here? The honored guests of House Fortom consorting with the Queen of Rats. Plotting insurrection, I shouldn't wonder. That won't do. Sickness is wont to fester and spread. It must be burnt out ere the infection takes hold. I reckon Sir would be happy to wield the irons himself. Well, so happens. I've got irons of my own. Such simple creatures, rats. Certain to attack when caught. Let us step outside, my lady. In here, your toys could hurt someone.
Whoa! There's one out. Get out, I'll help. Whoa! That flare! And now... For you! Oh, hi! That hurt me. You disgust me! And dead, okay. Wow. That ended rather quickly. I need to. I need to avoid his flare. Right there. And there's the close. Like, are you attacking your own character? Your own teammates? You disgust me. Got too many people on me. Filthy rats! 
to get rid of the other one. Oh god, what is that? They'll smash his head in. That's what I would do. There's no denying your gifts. A well-deserved reputation indeed. Lucky bastard. Nay, tis we who are lucky. Had we fought on, t'was but a matter of time before our conflict claimed the life of an innocent bystander. I thought the Heaven's Ward might come here as well. They came to the Temple Knight's headquarters. Aye. Sir Grinnow announced that the Lord Commander had been imprisoned under suspicion of heresy, and that the Heaven's Ward had been granted full authority in his stead. Then the Heaven's Ward now commands the Temple Knights. Those still loyal to Sir Emmerick answer to me. Alas, that amounts to but half our number. The other half, who opposed his promotion to Lord Commander, have gathered at the Vault as ordered. Bolster in the Guard already, eh? If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were expected. They know. I take it you're in charge around here? Hilda. And yes, the young master was just persuading me to join his lost cause. Convincing little beggar, isn't he? I, Your passion moves me. A bit. That. And the fact that we're sick of living off the leavings of our betters. If you've a mind to change things around here, then we've a mind to join you. Hang on a moment.
Wait. Oh, this is it. And I just call him. So we're actually going after...
The vault is now accessible. Yep, use the duty finder. Where? Now the vault is unlocked. 